today we're going to talk about three signs. Well, we're going to give you three signs. Three signs. One, two, three. Three signs that you're simping. What's up with it out there, man? It's your player partner, Rick, man. Back with another video, man. It's that kicking grits, man. Welcome back, baby. I'm glad you stay down with your partner, man. If you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Smash that like if you like the video. If you dislike it, go ahead and hit that dislike. It's all love either way, baby. You understand what I'm saying to you? But here at Kicking Grits, this is where we kick the shit, talk shit, and swallow spit, baby. But today, we're going to talk about three signs. Well, we're going to give you three signs. Three signs. One, two, three. Three signs that you're simping. And these are sign and indications for you to analyze yourself and the things that you're doing and the things that may indicate that you're simping. Most of all, what we do here <laughs> is we help you guys check in with yourself, man, because that's what we do. Checking in. I'm checking in with you guys, helping you guys check in with yourself to make sure that you guys are checking in on your health. You understand? Mental wise. Mental health. Mental health is a very serious issue. Well, it's a very serious, serious thing. And we have to check in with ourselves um, to make sure that we're mentally stable. You know, we don't want a bunch of crazies going on. This is not a channel where we're trying to influence people to do manipulative things or manipulative tactics and whatnot. This is a channel where we check in with everybody's mental health and we make sure that you are in good condition mentally. All right, so now let's get into this video, man. The first sign and indication that you are being a simp. If you're the type of guy that's always texting and texting this and texting and calling, hey, where you at? What are you doing? Who you with? What's going on? Hey, why you didn't answer my call? You took a long time to respond to me. You must be with somebody. If you're that guy, you're simping. You don't want to be that guy. Also, you need to check in with yourself, man, and make sure you're not that guy that is all on the social media. Who's this person that like your picture? Who's this person uh, that you're with in this picture? What's going on? What are you doing? If you're doing that, you're simping. Check yourself. Second sign indication that you're being a simp, and you're probably getting played. The woman probably don't even like it, because most women use guys in a club. You think about it, guys go in a club, you hanging out with your boys or whoever you're with or whatever, you know, and a female may approach you. Oh, hey, handsome, can you get me a drink? Oh, thank you, you're so nice. What about my girlfriend? She wants to drink too. She'll have the same thing. Oh, thank you, much appreciated. Have a nice night. <laughs> You know, you gotta look at them sometimes. They like sharp. A lot of females have a lot of benefits that men don't. We have, but we don't utilize as much as women. They utilize their sexuality in order to get wet. They're manipulative creatures by nature. But the thing is, are you gonna get manipulated? No. And now for the second sign. Second, second, two, one, two. Second sign and indication that you are simping. You're probably getting played. But the second sign that you're simping, you always use your money to try to, there's a bargaining chip for this, for that. You use your money to impress somebody, to impress the girl, to try to get the girl. She's probably using you anyway. She probably don't even like you. She just likes you because you're spending your money, you know, just to give you a little whiff of that. <laughs> And she probably has no intentions at all to give you anything close to her. You feel what I'm saying? She ain't gonna give you that ass, man. She just wants you to pay, 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 man. You know what I mean? You the PayPal. You not the pen pal. You, no, you the pen pal and the PayPal. You simping, man. You simping. Players use game, man. And I'm not here, like I said, this is not a, a, a channel where we give you guys understanding to use as manipulative tools. That is not the case here. Like I said, we checking in with mental health. And you probably need to check in with your health in general. What I do, I try to stay healthy by, you know, working out a little bit as much as I can, a little free time to keep clarity, to keep transparency with myself and have clarity in my mind uh, and then things that I do and keep, you know, stay in decent, good shape, you know, you understand? I mean, I'm not no, as you can see, you feel me? So yeah, I do that. And another thing I do, I use a product called Herbalife. And this is Herbalife 24. 
and this is Herbalife Healthy Meal. I use these two together and I, I, I've been using these for a while. I don't get to it every single day, but as much as I can, especially if I work out, you know, these two in combination together, it's a very good mix. And if you want to use or check out Herbalife products for yourself, you can go online, check out the link in the description. Yeah, the link in the description of this video and you can check out my personal store with Herbalife products and you can check out and, and uh, search through their products and see what fits you. And also too, like I told you guys, there's gonna be some side hustles I'm gonna throw at you and this is one of mine. So if you want to join the my side hustle and be, you know, make a little bit of money here and there, whatever, with Herbalife, you can also do that too. There's the link is also in the description. Becoming a distributor with Herbalife in my downline. You have to use my code, my member code, and you have to use my link that I have in the description. And all that information will be there for you guys. So now, said that to say this. So now, let's get to the third sign and indication that you're simple. If you're the type of guy to let a woman just play on you, say whatever they want to say to you, walk all over you like a doormat, and just you're still just kissing ass. Kiss ass. You're being a kiss ass. And that's another sign that you're a simp. You don't want to be a simp, man. You don't want to get played out here, man. You don't want to be no kiss ass. You don't want to get used and abused. That's not good for your mental. A lot of people run around here with broken hearts because they got played. And a lot of times it's like, you know, some guys get played by, by strippers. I've seen it. You know, they go to the strip club and the girls, they, you know, they're just doing their job. That's what they're there for. You're paying them for a service. They're going to act like they like you, but that don't mean that they actually really like you. They just want your money. They're there for work. It's the same way with your job or whatever you do. You may have to be a certain way and be happy and put on a smile. You know, um, even when you're sad, you may have to still put on that smile just to do your job and get the job done and get through the day and get your pay and do whatever you want to do. Whatever it is that you want to do with your money or take care of whatever you got to take care of. You got kids or whatever. You got a home rent, home mortgage payment. So you, you're like me, you want to get that extra money so that you can invest. And that's another video we're going to get to in a minute too. In a minute, well, a couple days or whatever. Just stay tuned. Like I said, subscribe, like, share the videos. Um, we're going to get to some uh, investing tips and stuff like that or whatever. Some of the things that I do, things or skills that I've picked up along the way. Um, and uh, we'll share that with you guys in probably one of the next videos or something. But like I said, man, don't be that sim, man. Don't be the sim. Be the player, but not the manipulative. Be the good guy, the good player, you know, that has the transparency. And to elaborate just a little bit on the previous video, um, that I shared with you guys about how to be a player on part one. Um, we're gonna get to part two soon, so y'all got you guys stay tuned. But like I said, transparency, telling the truth, absolutely. Everybody's situation and circumstances are different; they may differ from each other. So, telling the truth is absolutely the positive thing to do. Um, it's the best thing for you guys to do. But you want to protect yourself still too. At the same time, know who you're telling the truth to. You don't want to get game ran on you. You don't want to be, uh, you know, get game ran on you and then and some scammer chick comes along and then she takes you for everything. You don't want that to happen. So you got to be smart about the things that you do too as well and be smart about the information that you reveal to the people that you are dealing with. So I said that to say this, don't be a simp.